What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Now today, I'm gonna to show you how to make your own Facebook banner video. Let's get into it. All right, so a Facebook banner video, super cool and super easy to create if you have a Facebook page. Totally recommend to use one if you have it. So right now I'm using the intro from two videos ago and it's time to upgrade. It's really old. Come on, we gotta do something about that. All right, so we're jumping into Vegas Pro, creating our Facebook banner, resizing our video for Facebook banner, super simple. All right, so now we're gonna drag our video to our timeline. All right, thank you very much. As you can see, this is the size of our video normally, right? Which you just saw. So now we're gonna go to our cog. We're gonna change our sequence settings. Here's our template. We're gonna go to our width and we're gonna type in 820 by 312. We'll apply it and you can automatically see how our frame size for our window has changed. We have a lot more real estate now to work with. Now we have to make it work and fit with our Facebook banner profile or our frame size. So we've got to make it fit. So we've got to go to our track motion settings. So we're going to go to our hamburger button right here. And if it's not already there, we're going to, this is, where, this is what we're looking for, our track motion. If it's not already there, go to your hamburger, edit visible button, and click on, check on track motion and okay. And it'll show up, All right? I'll bring this here. All right, now you're going to take the corner of your box and all you do is you're just going to zoom it in and adjust it. All right, so we'll go to a certain part of our video where the uh, the name, the title of my video shows. And I want everything. I want the title, the information. I want it, everything matching up centered towards the end so we're not having to do adjustments throughout this, throughout this particular video. Uh, so I'm going to probably raise it up just a little more. I can also use the arrow keys if I want so I'm not losing too much control. And I like it right there. All right, so we'll go there and I'll play. All right, it's looking good. It's all centered and framed in size. Everything is looking good. All right, now here's the thing. When it comes to a Facebook banner video, it's got to be a minimum of 20 seconds. And our video right now is probably around uh, 11, 11 seconds. We got to make this at least 20 seconds. I'm going to highlight my clips. Make a copy and paste. I'll bring them back to back and now our clips are together and to make one longer clip and now our clip is about 22 seconds long we're good to go now keep this in mind um we're just kind of a adjusting a a single video if you have a video that has multiple different cuts then you're gonna have to cut that video up and adjust each of the sizes to match the frame size for your facebook banner video with that said in mind if you're gonna make your your facebook banner video from scratch remember to shoot for the fa for the Facebook banner in mind. Shoot wide, shoot like a, a you know, a landscape-ish type if you can. So so when when you're at, when you're in the editing room, or when you're in editing software, you can actually compose your shots, crop in so you can have a proper look. If not, if you're just kind of like shooting normal, everything is going to be up close in your face. We just kind of got lucky here because it's a it's a title sequence. So we're not dealing too much with um, with like faces and bodies and all that stuff. So keep that in mind. Um, shoot, shoot for the banner in mind. Okay, with that being said, uh, let's go ahead and render this out. So we'll go to our render button, render as. Um, I like to do 4K, so I'll pick 4K, 20. Let's do a customize. Let's, let's send this to my desktop, please. Yes, desktop. We'll call this Vegas Banner. We'll customize our template. Okay. Then we're going to our frame size and we'll go slick on customize frame size. And we'll type in 820 again by 312. Right. And the reason why I picked 4K is so it gives us a higher bit rate for our Facebook uh, video. You don't have to. It's up to me. I like to do it that way. Whatever. I'll press OK. Right. And then once that's done, I will go ahead and render uh, like that. All right, there we go. Our 20 second video video is done. Now let's go to Facebook. All right, here we go. Let's click on this where it says change cover. Let's go to upload photo and video. And here's my, my file that I just rendered. We'll go and press open. 
and it's gonna upload and it's gonna and it's gonna do some encoding okay so there we go we see that our bit our video is now our Facebook banner it gives you the option to drag and to reposition um, but that's just that's if it gives you the the option um, when you're uploading a video it gives you the op the opportunity or the option to also upload in 820 by 462 that's the recommended maximum size for some reason I don't know, results may vary whenever I try that it always crashes on me take it for what it's worth so I just stick with 820 by 312 um, go ahead be brave and try with those uh, that frame size as well and let me know what your results are but that's it you know all I have to do is just press next okay automatically play video in a loop publish Okay, yes, publish. And it does it spinning and boom, that's it. Our Facebook cover video is open. And now we also have, we also got sound to it as well. All right, guys, that is it for this video. If you liked it, go ahead, leave a like. If you want to see more helpful videos like this, go ahead and subscribe. And as always, guys, share the love, learn, do, and share. I'll catch you next video. Bye.